Cryptocurrency is a digital or virtual form of currency that uses cryptography for security and operates on a decentralized network, typically based on blockchain technology. It enables secure and transparent peer-to-peer -peer transactions without the need for intermediaries like banks. In this video, we will explore the exciting world of cryptocurrency and its potential as an investment opportunity. We will start by discussing what cryptocurrency is and how it differs from traditional forms of currency. We will also explore the technology behind cryptocurrencies, such as blockchain, and their role in enabling secure transactions. Finally, we will dive into the world of investing in cryptocurrency and provide some tips and strategies for those looking to get started. Whether you're a seasoned investor or just getting started, this video is sure to provide valuable insights into the world of cryptocurrency and how to invest in this exciting new asset class. What is cryptocurrency? The term crypto refers to a class of digital assets that can be used for a variety of purposes. For instance, the primary goal of the development of Bitcoin was to create a decentralized method of payment. In what has come to be known as decentralized finance, Ethereum permits developers to construct automated applications. Additionally, Tether is a stablecoin whose value is dependent on the United States dollar. The cryptographic techniques that enable individuals to buy, sell, or trade cryptocurrencies in a secure manner without the need for a third party, such as a government or financial institution, to validate a transaction are what gives them their name. Why do people invest in cryptocurrencies? The belief that a cryptocurrency's value will rise in tandem with the rising demand for that cryptocurrency motivates investors to make investments in cryptocurrencies. Let's use Bitcoin as a simplified illustration. Theoretically, consumers might switch more of their dollars to Bitcoin, and businesses might welcome more Bitcoin payments. If they discovered that using Bitcoin was superior to using the US dollar, if this were to happen on a large scale, there would be more demand for Bitcoin which would raise its value in dollars. Consequently, if you had purchased a Bitcoin prior to the rise in demand, you might have been able to sell it for more money than you paid for it, making a profit. Ethereum operates in the same manner. The cryptocurrency Ether is housed on the Ethereum blockchain, where developers can create financial apps without the need for a third-party financial institution. Read more about blockchains here. Developers must use Ether to build and run applications on Ethereum. As more applications are built on the Ethereum blockchain, demand for Ether should rise. How are cryptocurrencies created? A process known as mining, which Bitcoin uses, is one common method of creating cryptocurrencies. Computers use a lot of energy to solve intricate puzzles called Bitcoin mining. To ensure that the network's transactions are genuine, the owners of those computers may be eligible to receive newly created cryptocurrency as a reward. Other cryptocurrencies make and distribute tokens in different ways, and many of them have much less of an impact on the environment. How Bitcoin mining works Most people find that buying cryptocurrency from an exchange or another user is the simplest way to acquire it. It can be helpful to familiarize yourself with the most frequently traded assets in the cryptocurrency industry to get a sense of the industry. A list of the biggest cryptocurrencies by market capitalization can be found below. How does cryptocurrency work? Blockchain is a technology that supports cryptocurrencies. It keeps track of who owns what and keeps a tamper-proof record of transactions. An issue that had arisen in previous attempts to create solely digital currencies was addressed by using blockchains. Preventing individuals from attempting to duplicate their spending by making copies of their holdings. Depending on how they are used, individual cryptocurrencies can be referred to as coins or tokens. Some can be used to participate in particular software programs like games and financial products, while others are intended to be units of exchange for goods and services. Still, others are stores of value. Why are there so many kinds of cryptocurrency? It is essential to keep in mind that Bitcoin is distinct from cryptocurrencies as a whole. The market is large, even though Bitcoin is the first and most valuable cryptocurrency. According to the market research website CoinMarketTap.com, more than 22,000 distinct cryptocurrencies are traded publicly. Additionally, although some cryptocurrencies have total market valuations in the hundreds of billions of dollars, others are obscure and have virtually no value. If you're thinking about getting into cryptocurrency, it might be helpful to start with one that is widely traded and has been around for a while. 
guides to some of the most popular cryptocurrencies, such as Bitcoin and some altcoins, or Bitcoin alternatives, have been produced by NerdWallet. The first and most valuable cryptocurrency is Bitcoin. When it comes to more complex financial transactions than those supported by Bitcoin, Ethereum is frequently used. Cardano is a rival to Ethereum that is controlled by one of its co-founders. Solana is a rival to Ethereum that places an emphasis on speed and value for money. Dogecoin started as a joke and is now one of the most valuable cryptocurrencies. Litcoin is a modification of Bitcoin designed to simplify payments. Shiba Toki is yet another token with a dog theme and more intricate mechanics. Stablecoins, a class of cryptocurrencies such as Tether and USDC, have values that are designed to remain stable in comparison to real-world assets like the dollar. Thank you for Thanks. being a part of our incredible journey here at Out Channels. We hope you enjoyed the content and found inspiration. Don't forget to hit that like button if you had a great time and subscribe to stay updated with our latest videos.